connect your iPad to the combined Wi-Fi. From the iPad menu, get to the Wi-Fi box and look for the Wi-Fi of IDL, then connect to it. Remember to select IDL Harvest also on the terminal. Click first on the black combine silhouette, then on the Harvest Mode icon. Now check to have IDL Harvest selected on the box on the top of the screen, then switch on the iPad button on the top right corner of the screen. Launch the Smart Connect app in the iPad to be connected automatically to IDL. Now engage the system by pushing the joystick on the right and keep it for 2 seconds with the combine running faster than 1 kph. The ideal harvest is now running and a green icon on the first quarter will appear. Let's go now to the Smart Connect app. The first page visualized is the mapping visualization. On the header of the page, there are four main icons indicating the four available pages. The actual page shown will be highlighted with a red line under each of those icons. For the mapping visualization, you will see on the left side of the screen a column with machine runtime details and on the right side of the same screen a column with operation details. A simple tap and hold of any of the tiles can be used to customize what is shown. In this example, we will display how to change a different machine runtime detail view. On the footer of the mapping page, what you will see is the section of the header. In this case, the green dots will switch to white if you overlap an area already harvested. In this way, the overlap will not be recorded into the actor counter. Right below the other icons, you will find three mapping customization controls. Machine orientation, 2D to 3D switch, and the type of mapping coverage from which you can choose between the type of visualization you prefer. Clicking on the rev counter icon on the toolbar, will get you to the premium dashboard when equipped. From here, you can customize your dashboard screens between multiple options. First, you will visualize the default screen. Then, clicking on the icon on the top left corner, you can add more tile visualization screens clicking on the green icon. Now, to edit your preferred screen visualization, click on the edit icon on the bottom right corner. Now click on the green icon on the top left corner of the screen and the multiple choice menu will appear. Listed in this menu, there are different visualization possibilities. For example, click on grain loss and pick one of the many graphical visualizations you prefer. Each function has multiple setup that you can choose. Of course, it is a drag and drop function. Click on your choice and drop it on the right side of the screen. You can repeat this action until you reach your preferred visualization between the many options available. Now use the toolbar to switch to the icon with the combined silhouette or swipe left. This section is composed of three pages. The first quick reference screen to keep under control the main values while harvesting. On the top of the page you can choose between simplified or advanced visualization. Then you find the rotor graph showing where threshing of grain is occurring while the sieve graph shows distribution. The bar graph shows rotor loss, sieve loss and tailing loss. On the footer of the screen, find three different buttons starting from the left corner. The on-off button to shut off or on the automation. The blue triangle icon is the shortcut to get to the automation screen in the setting area of Smart Connect. The camera icon, by tapping on it you can display the grain quality visually using the onboard clean grain quality camera at the top of the elevator. No more need to exit the cab to check it out. Swipe left again to reach the second quick reference screen focused on grain distribution on and machine balance. By dragging the white slider, you can move from front to back of IDL to see how performance affects lateral load. 
Remember, all the graphs of the system update in real time. Pitch and roll icons of the combine are visible on the bottom of the screen. Swipe left once again to get to the third page, the histogram screen. It visualizes dynamic graphs to show both real-time and the last 30 minutes data of the different functions of IDEAL. Swipe up and down to quickly check the multiple functions. Tap now on the gear icon to access the settings of Smart Connect. From General tab on the left you choose your unit of measurement, metric or imperial. In the About tab you will find general information on the software version. On the Map tab, operator can choose different moving map background between three options based on preference. Remember, to use satellite or street view visualization, you need to be connected to a cellular network. The last button is the Ideal Harvest Suite setup. By tapping on it, you will access to the menu to automate and optimize the performance of the Ideal Combine from Smart Connect. Using the premium target triangle, operator can reduce broken grain, material other than grain, and grain loss. The bar graph will change according to the chosen setting. Tapping on the camera icon, you will access to the onboard clean grain quality camera. The slider on the top right allows to choose balance between the preferred target or higher throughput. The system will automatically and constantly optimize the harvesting setting at the change of the crop conditions according to the operator selected strategy. Remember, for the best performance of the system, it is recommended to allow 5 to 10 minutes between each change in the triangle.